Hello, welcome back. Let's see now. You see corporate Yonlon clone number one and it friends in his horizon. What? I I don't understand, Yonlon. What what do you mean? Also, this thing keeps doing the silly. Is that better? Mm hmm. <laughs> oh, if I decide to raise to 300. Oh, I see. I see. Yeah. Um, please don't break t uh, Twitch TOS. Just, just putting that out there. Yeah, so we got the codec Bren coordinates. Yeah. And I think we prepped a squad to do this. Oh, we've already decided to race to 300. The race is on. Mm -hmm. Yep, we did everything. Just checking if I smooth-brained any of this. Last stream. Now it all looks good. All right. Is John Lund cloning John Lund against the toss of Twitch? I mean. Ethic ethical issues aside of cloning Jonlin, I don't think you can um, create bot accounts just to, you know, give follows, etc. I think that's against the, the toss. You would never do such a thing, but you're not about paying someone a couple of bucks to do it for you. I see. I mean, I did have somebody who tried to troll me at one stream. They went to some web, web page and, I don't know, they paid some money to attempt to troll me. Which is amazing, they paid money to a website to try. And they sent me 5,000 followers in a quick succession and... My uh, notifications were broken that day, <laughs> so nothing happened. <laughs> and they basically just wasted the money trying to troll me and my thing was broken just that day, so... Yeah. Yeah, I think multiple accounts might be against the toss as well. Okay, Leo, that is a fair point. If we actually really biologically clone Jönlund, I, I believe the clones should be allowed to have their own Twitch accounts. Are you okay with that, Jönlund? Can we, can we actually clone you? Can we make clone troopers? Shen and Tygen barely managed to pull these coordinates from that... 5,000 followers cost like 10 bucks. Huh. So they basically wasted 10 bucks. You locked it up once for a friend? Okay. You're fine with the cloning, Jenlin? Alright, so... I'll send over the paperwork and, and we'll get the cloning facility running. Uh... And I, I, we need to we need a cool name like the Jonlon project or something like that. We're neck and neck dollar. Oh wow! So you are saying I caught up? So you are saying there's a chance? I have been ignoring whatever um, Central has been saying. What am I doing? Oh right, Codex facility, uh, Codex Bren. Um, mm -hmm. which direction is this map going? Okay, it's quite far in that direction. Exactly same followers. Okay, so gonna head this way, find the thing, blap the blap the golf ball, yada yada yada, everybody happy. Yes. A little bit of a risky move. Well I found something, that's for sure. Well, let's do some tests and see what happens. Oh, well, we found something, yeah. Confirmed. What what did you see, Whiskey? Are you kidding me, bruh? Okay, okay. This is gonna be an interesting mission. Bandits. And you're f that's Flank City. I thought you'd never ask. Ripper. I go as ordered. So I'm expecting to kind of do a beagle rush type thing here where we just, you know, they walk into us, something, 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 overwatch kills, wreck them next turn. We could 
Oh, we can't dominate the Royal Sovereign. Gosh darn it. All right. Well, I'm fully expecting to get revealed. So how did, like, did we find everything on the map in one move? What is that? That's three, four, uh, five, six, seven, eight up here. Are we not revealed? Oh, there we go. Nope. How are we not revealed? How are we not revealed? Barely not revealed. Um, well, I'm sure it's gonna happen this turn, so... Just gonna get the Null Ward up, and I'm sure we'll be revealed this turn. And the um, Beagle Rush strat will be activated. Are you really gonna get out of line of sight, or are we gonna get everything pulled? Excuse me? Did you just not... What is that stumpy stumpy sound? The... My dudes, my dudes, my dudes. We can see all of these three, so I mean technically... My dudes, I really, really would have liked y'all to, to activate kindly. Um, <laughs> so I'ma try this brave move by Rust Buckets. Okay, that works. And I have whiskey up here in high cover. Um, Bandit, well, since you have free actions, give Rust Bucket a little bit of a love tap. Surely, surely we're gonna activate something this turn. Don't, don't call me Shirley. Are, are you kidding me right now? Are they real? Are they literally dancing around my guys? Or are we getting more BS? Are you... Look at this! Look at this! Look at this! <laughs> one of these days, Louis. One of these days. Um, mm hmm Surely. How can you all avoid rust seeing rust bucket? There we go. Now we're talking. Did I just choose to activate on the entire map? Or at least that guy's going to his people. How much HP am I activating? Like a hundo? Or zero? So, uh, whatever this is, these two are 50, 77. Yeah, over a hundred HP, HP being activated. Um, Are you all? Are you all for real? <laughs> I understand. The game is trying so hard not to get ambushed. Yeah, no, right, John Lynn. Hey, it is Sammy. Welcome in. How are you doing? Really? My shield's expired? Are you kidding me? I mean, we we have been trying to get these guys to s see that giant robot for like five turns. 
What is this? Game? Excuse me. Are you for real right now? Like, are you actually for real? Um, like, this pod has not moved. It's like they know we're here. On legend, game doesn't cheat in your favor, but it still cheats with anti-ambush patrol routes. Yeah, that's rubbish, though, isn't it? Like okay, now now I'm in the for science camp here. Surely you will see rust bucket. Really, game? Really? Really? <sighs> okay, I'm gonna give you all one more try. Otherwise, I might do something drastic. Surely you will see Rust Bucket now. Surely. There we go. Well, they saw Bleed Out. The stealthiest robot in existence. It is, John Lennon. It's uncanny how they stop one tile before revealing and just stay there. Okay. So, did you just straight up clone? Nobody shot, even shot at you. I, I, I thought we would have more over Overwatches. Oh, we killed the Sovereign. Yeah, that guy had a lot of HP. Hi there, friend. How you doing? Oh, zone defense, yes. Alright. Um, I so I activated the world. Now what? What's the domination options here? We could get an elite specter. I'm not opposed to getting an elite specter. So we can get any one of these two. We need to deal with the codices and um, the fun lancer. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna overdrive. We're gonna use lightning strike to kill the lancer for free. And grab the loot. All in one swift action. Yes, sir. I'll tell you what that thing isn't. It isn't Excellent. yours, so leave it appreciated. The double loot. The double loot. Okay, now I have shots at whatever I please. If we crit and high roll, this could kill without the split. How am I gonna deal with the splits? What do we have here? Flechette? No. Who has blue screens? Who's got them blue screens? Whiskey? No. Ripper? You have the blue screens. Yeah, so end that Codex Prime. Their 
Um, that's a 50-60. That's not any better. But at least it's not gonna split after this. 50% it dies, 50% it teleports. Okay, dead. Uh huh. Let's see if we can end this trooper. Aperture science engineers believe that Gek is most likely incapable of feeling much pain. Over a piece of cheese. Um. I think we're gonna try to kill this. Oh yeah. What's this? Is this a guaranteed kill? Yes. I just struck you from the permanent record. Okay, okay. We're gonna dominate that last specter, I believe. Do I have anybody with multiple shots left? Bandit. I would like for you to finish off the lid, but we're gonna give you the range bonus first. <laughs> Come on, 98, you got this. Alright. Arnie, you have all the shots here. Don't really need to do anything crazy, just shoot. We'll send up whiskey to finish it off, and then we will mind control the elite specter. Actually, let's do that first. Let's get a null ward up again. We'll uh, get some, some help here. He's got decent aim and lots of survivability options. These days is saying, are you immune? Immune to fire acid and mental. Okay, good talk. Rage strike this thing. Reaction. Kill it. Who's keeping score? And this dude. Am I? How likely am I to kill here? Not at all. So we're gonna frost slash and freeze him. I said we're gonna frost slash and freeze. There we go. Okay, more lids. That's what everybody wants. Oh, the other one didn't activate. Right. Now, who wants the the kill? Bandit, if we can. And I love it. At least we're gonna move up. lose high cover but I also don't want to lose you know cover do I care though is there anything that's gonna be shooting at me mm, no okay let's uh, soften him up Ripper can you get closer yep Uh, let's see now. Question is, I want to give this kill to Bandit if possible. That's 82 to get the kill. Do it. The joke's mm -hmm. on you. Understood. Moving out. Target 
Okay, he's dead. Frostbug is gonna pick up the loot and then we move up. Just ten remaining. I think there's like five lids, something at fascinating. Uh, the final destination. Decide which is my favorite. I don't want any more activations this. this turn, so I'm just gonna stand Come still. Reloading weapon. Watch order confirmed. Yeah, I saw something standing on top of the thing there. Missed. More lids. So I'm gonna send up rust buckets here. Guess what I'm gonna do? My bombard and then kinetic strike my way up there, and then we'll see what we find and deal with it. I'm expecting there really to only be um, lids left. Ah, uh, that takes me back. Oh, hello. Oh. Two codices. It's fine, we have Ripper. I was about to say, you're gonna get a counter strike, right? Perfect. Okay, these two fools shouldn't be a problem. Oh, there's a. It's a rather interesting layout. Usually it's fully open here so we can approach. You know what? Yeah, we're just gonna wrath our way to victory here. And and this codex. The light has left them. Is it just me or is our squad a little bit too strong at this point? Come on, people, move it, move it! Oh, did I find more? I found more. Spoke too soon. I violated my rule of do all my movements before I start shooting because I would have liked to use Dripper Sing before I did that. The the thing, you know, the thing. Uh, what should I call it? Um, uh, explosive action. Yes, that thing. Arnie. You have some options. You could possibly hit both of those if you really, if you weren't up there. I mean, we only need to kill one. The second one is gonna blue, blue bubble, which I'm not that worried about. Whiskey. It's chrysalids. Could be an issue. I think we'll do though is probably kill this one and whiskey deals with this thing and actually we we'll probably deal use bleed out to give somebody an extra action would that be ripper can what can you do can't really see those. Uh, the code is I mean. Bandit doesn't have any ammo, so he can't really do anything useful. So, I mean, we could dual strike. We can't because we can't see the codex. Okay. So what you're telling me is if I take this flanking shot, we can dual strike our way to victory. Okay, just keep going further and further. Actually, hold on. What's your regular damage here? That's enough. That's a guaranteed kill. You don't even need to dual strike.
uh, Arnie. Maybe we dual strike from here. Actually, I don't know what what your hit is gonna be like here. I wish I could. What's your base aim? Seventy four. In high into high cover. That's gonna be a thirty something. Unless we can remove the cover, which I kind of sort of cannot. Could. Ooh, hello. Really, really useful. Whiskey. You might be able to run and gun up here and end the codex. And then. Bandit can combat protocol here, and Arnie can probably do something useful as well. Okay, yep, that's the plan. That's the plan. I'm coming for you. Yep. Double time. And just keep going deeper. This is something you don't like too much about XCOM. It gets too easy in Endgame. Yeah. Like, I I agree. I know why they did it, and it makes sense from like, oh hello, from like not annoying new players, but it's also like for experienced players it's a little bit too easy in the end game. Okay Arnie, how are you gonna get a shot on, on that lid? You need to get up there. Okay. Nice night for a walk. Could frost. Do I want to? I think it's gonna go for the rust bucket and gonna get swung at, so. I think it's fine. We're also gonna overwatch here. An off chance that it goes somewhere else. Go. Anyway, back to testing. Yeah. Um, there are some mods that uh, rebalance, uh, not rebalance, but rework the Golden Path missions. We're green to go. We're green to go. Cover me. So you have a uh, disappointment. Slightly different okay. experience, and I found that they work pretty well. The reason I'm not using them right now is I didn't know like if they were gonna mess Come with on! um covert infiltration. Good copy. Moving on target. Let's move already. I stand ready. So yeah, what I'm doing, I'm just Getting everybody reloaded and regrouped so that our next engagement will be in our favor. Because if we are half out of ammo and scattered scattered all around the place, then uh, then our engagements will not be as good. It's as simple as that. Okay, so wait, it's facing that way? We usually approach from this direction. 